And before those governors weighed in, Augusta Mayor Hardy Davis over the weekend issuing an executive order, one that closes bars, restaurants, movie theaters, and others. News Channel 6's senior reporter George Ascala covering Augusta's new reality. Really, what a difference a few hours make. Eerily quiet downtown Augusta during lunch hour after the mayor mandates restaurants and bars cannot be open because of the coronavirus. The welcome mat no longer out at Augusta restaurants. Take out only as Augusta takes steps to combat the coronavirus. Steps that are not pain free. It's going to hurt some business throughout the country, not only our community. But throughout the country, but the point, the point is, do you worry about your business or you worry about the public? Mayor Davis issuing an executive order Saturday mandating the closing of certain businesses where people gather, like bars and restaurants. If we're going to be a stronger, safer community, we have to employ these practices now. We can't continue to wait to do that. I think the mayor did exactly, and the commission did exactly what. The majority of the citizens in Augusta expected, and not only expected, but wanted us to do. This comes after a commission discussion Thursday where the mayor said a nightclub on Gordon Highway had 300 people inside. I'm not going to say that the club was the reason, but uh, actions like the club was one of the reasons, I'm sure. As Augusta closes diners, Columbia County is allowing restaurants to remain open as long as CDC guidelines are followed. It can certainly lead to confusion. Uh, there's no doubt about that. But once again, uh, we have to do what we feel is best for our citizens. Uh, they will do what they feel is best for their citizens. Meanwhile, Governor Kemp is leaving it to local governments to make the call on closing businesses. I think it would be a little simpler if the governor had given out direct instruction across the state, but he didn't. He left it in local hands. Commissioner John Clark saying one criticism could be not that the city took this action, but rather the city could have taken this action sooner. He says a lesson learned for next time. In Augusta, George Escala, WJBF News Channel 6.